Horner Woods offers an enchanting interactive walking experience. With acres of woodland, the path snakes around the ancient trees, teeming with fungi, birds and at the right time red deer. This is one of the longer explorer walks, with a few climbs and uneven paths in places. There is a National Trust car park just a short distance off the A39 between Porlock and Minehead. Today we're going to explore this ancient woodland, which has an amazing abundance of wildlife for us to explore. Come on, let's get stuck in. The natural stone path starts from the National Trust car park, takes you along the eastern side of Horner Water, then crosses the stream and takes you up to look down into the wooded valley and back towards the car park. Simply follow the pink arrows the National Trust have provided. This place really is magical. Outside it's daylight, but in here it's cool. And the colours have that real softness for this time of year. In this extensive ancient wood, there are impressive oak trees over 500 years old. These gnarled branches are like something Tolkien would have dreamt up. Honeycott Estate covers 12,500 acres and was donated to the Trust by Sir Richard Ackland in 1944. If you're really quiet, you'll hear a faint rumble. Horner takes its name from the Saxon word Hörner, a wonderfully expressive word meaning snorer. Wood warblers, lesser spotted woodpeckers and kestrels can be spotted in the branches and next to the stream. If you come here early enough in the morning, you might spot red deer grazing in amongst the trees. The single span bridge is largely unaltered and survives well. It is one of a rare group of early pack horse bridges reserved for pedestrian use. Thankfully, the tea rooms are open to grab a cuppa. What a spectacular adventure that was through enchanting woodland. If you'd like to discover more, then please visit exmoorwalks.org and join us for another.